Hi there, Hugh. So we just launched the Freefly RTK GPS, and I'm going to talk through a little bit about this product and show it installed on an Alta X. So inside the box, you will find the two RTK GPS units. So these are circuit boards inside a plastic enclosure. The first enclosures or the first units that we're shipping uh, have just come off of our 3D printer. So we've got a nice HP 3D printer, prints really nice parts. They're not quite as nice as the molded plastic ones, but uh, that'll be for the first 20 or so units. Um, so there's these two units, and then there are these Max Tenna helical antenna. Helical antennas, these are dual band antennas. And kind of the cool thing about these, we've got a nice little O-ring so it seals, screws into the little RTK unit. And the cool thing about these is um, some GPS antennas only have sky view that kind of goes straight up like that. These Max Tenna's, they can see a really huge field of view for antennas, so you get massive satellite reception. Um, we were testing the other day, getting between 25 and 30 satellites with these. So you get really good satellite reception, really good lock, really good horizontal and vertical accuracy. Um, kind of continuing down through the package, you get the, we got, I think it's a three meter long USB-C or A to C cable, and that allows you to plug in the base station on the ground to the laptop. Then you connect to all the ground control, and that's what allows you to get the RTK corrections. Um, so yeah, so let's say, I just wanna put the antenna on this one and then I was gonna show the cool mag lock that Eric came up with. So Eric came up with this nice little design that has molded features as well as magnets in here. And then you can mount this to a variety of different things via quarter 20 and they're just magnets on there. And I'll show you on a tripod. So when we're using RTK, we, we leave our mag locks installed on a bunch of our little tripods and then when you get to the field you just mag lock it on there plug in the USB-C plug that into your laptop to your ground station this surveys in for a little while plug in your power on your drone and you're good to go um, I want to show how the RTK unit for the uh, Alta X works so this mounts in place you would remove the stock GPS it uses the, the existing wiring, and then it actually mounts directly to uh, some mounting holes that we had put on Alta X for accessories. And I'm gonna fold the aircraft so you can see all the folding and everything still works just fine, except for when it hits the box. Um, but yeah, it folds right up, doesn't hit anything on the RTK. Uh, and you get, the, you get the nice performance with the great antenna. The, this is using a U-Blox F9P module, which is a really, really nice module. We've been using U-Blox GNS S modules for a long time. They're super reliable. Uh, the, the things you'll notice when you're flying your Alta, um, you'll notice centimeter, when it's fully surveyed in, you have a 3D fix. You'll notice centimeter level accuracy in horizontal and then almost that in vertical. So you'll notice much better height hold performance if you switch to using GPS rather than Barrow. And kind of a cool test you can do is leave it and hover very close to the ground and you'll be able to see how precisely it can maintain elevation over long periods of time. And you can also see that in some of the demo videos that we created to showcase uh, RTK GPS. So this just went live on the store. It's available now. Um, we have a bunch of information on the wiki. We have a bunch of videos that we posted today and kind of uh, supporting information about it. Um, I think it's going to be a really valuable addition to our drone fleet for certain industrial customers. Um, the nice thing is, uh, even if you're not using the base station, you still get really improved satellite lock and accuracy with even just the RTK receiver on the drone. So that's kind of nice if you don't want to deal with setting up the base station for every single flight, you still get quite a nice upgrade on GPS performance. So if you have any questions, uh, hit us up and we'd be happy to answer. I think that pretty much covers everything to do with RTK. Thanks.